My name is Dina Lazardo, and I am a software consultant for Walters Kluwer CCH. In this video, I will teach you how to recalculate bill rates using an administrative utility in practice management. So let's say a few of my staff were recently promoted to senior accountants. Since the promotion, their bill rates have changed, but I just recently updated the bill rates in their employee profile. Using this utility, I can update any release time and or their posted WIP transactions within a certain time frame to reflect the updated bill rates. In the administration module, to access this feature, click on utilities at the top of the screen. Choose recalculate WIP time and expense rates. On this window, I select the date range. So the bill rates increased effective June 15th. So I choose June 15th up to the current day to make sure I include include any time release before I updated the bill rates. Select which options apply to your situation. WIP transactions that have not been billed. Release time entry transactions not in WIP if not using real time release or both. I choose WIP transactions that have not been billed since I use real time release. Then choose the update print option to select what to do. Print the register if you would like to review the list before updating the transactions. Print the register and update the transactions at the same time. Or choose to update transactions without printing the register. When selecting the last two options, you also have the option to log corrections on the WIP corrections and deletions report. I select the last option and click the box to include the corrections on the report. I then choose the employees who need to be updated. Right click to select all employees or I can use the control button to choose the employees that I need to select. I will select Emma Brown and Bob Cratchit. At the bottom of the window, it indicates how many employees are selected. I click OK to update the WIP and time entries. The program will let you know how many transactions were updated and I click OK. Thank you for taking the time to review this video. We hope you found it helpful and informative. For additional training and consulting resources, click the link below to visit our training and consulting webpage.